Who decided that a cauliflower is a substitute for a potato? I often wonder this, but then I'm reminded when I have a dish as incredible as this one. I don't see any cauliflower in here, just comfort food heaven. Today we're making a loaded cauliflower casserole. It's the keto version of a loaded baked potato just without the carbs or the potato. And the beauty about all of these ingredients that go in here, no one is gonna know that it's keto or has cauliflower unless you tell them. I tell my kids that it has caltatoes in it. What's a caltato? You know, it's a California potato because Californians don't really eat a lot of carbs and they use cauliflower instead. Caltato. I don't get it. I know, it's a bad joke. It's not even a joke. First, we're gonna add 24 ounces of cauliflower to a square baking dish. I could cut up this whole head of cauliflower, but that's a little bit too much effort for me today, so we're just gonna use bag florets instead. Then we add three tablespoons of melted butter, and if you have any leftover baking grease, you wanna add that in place of the butter because this will really up-level your dish. Then the seasoning. It's one teaspoon of salt, a half a teaspoon of garlic powder, a half a teaspoon of onion powder, and a quarter teaspoon of pepper. Then grab your favorite spatula. We're using the Friends Turkey spatula today. And mix it to coat all over. Huh, this caltato doesn't really wanna get roasted. Well, tough luck. Put this in a 425 degree oven for 20 minutes or until your florets are softened and you can stick a fork in it. While that's roasting, I would normally just go pour myself a glass of wine and then watch some angry Karen videos on YouTube with my kids, but it's only 10 o'clock in the morning, so we're gonna go with something else. Since we're making comfort food, I'm gonna make a mug of hot chocolate that's only one gram of carbs using my favorite electrolytes, Element, who is the sponsor of today's video. Chocolate is one of the many fun flavors, but Element has other flavors like raspberry, watermelon, citrus, orange. To make the hot chocolate, you just add hot water instead of cold water. Element contains a science-backed electrolyte mix of 1,000 milligrams of sodium, 200 milligrams of potassium, and 60 milligrams of magnesium. Right now, Element is offering my viewers a free sample pack with any order. That's eight single-serving packets free with any Element order. It's a great way so that you can try all eight flavors or just to share with your kids or a salty friend or a salty kid. Get yours at drinkelement.com slash ketofocus. This deal is only available through my link down below, so you must go to d-r-i-n-k-l-m-n-t dot com slash ketofocus. All right, let's go finish our casserole. To a medium bowl, add a quarter cup of heavy cream, a quarter cup of sour cream, two cups of shredded cheddar cheese, two ounces of cream cheese, six slices of bacon that's chopped up, and a quarter cup of sliced green onion. Mix that together until it's all smooth. And then we're gonna spread this over our roasted cauliflower. And I like to top it with a bit more cheddar cheese because why not? Then we're gonna put this back in the oven for five to 10 minutes. You wanna cook it just until your cheese is melted. This casserole smells like Thanksgiving. It's the ultimate comfort food. Since the holidays are coming up, and if you're like me, you're already planning your attack on what to make for all those holiday meals. Well, I have the ultimate playlist of keto holiday favorites. These are recipes that nobody really is gonna know they're keto, so you can safely bring them to family dinner. Just click right here. 